Okay guys, so it's Dread Scoper here again, and as you can see, I am almost about to get into something. This is going to be something new that I do, and basically what it is, is I'm just going to be taking some players that I like to play with, um, and I'm just going to be showing you guys how I play with them, and how I would go through uh, situations with them. So right now I'm going through with a relief pitcher, I'm just going to start off on the Orioles, Field. I don't know if it matters what field I'm on. Um, if you guys want me to play in a certain field, let me know. I don't really care. I'm just going to play in this field because that's which one I'm playing on. But anyways, I'm going to be playing with Kelvin Herrera, who is a relief pitcher for the Royals, as you can see right there. Um, and he's probably like my... F no, he is my favorite relief pitcher right now. He is a very hard-throwing righty with a solid changeup and curveball. Uh, so let me get right into it. I picked the Blue Jays because I figure they have, like, probably one of the best lineups. They got Tulowitzki, Donaldson, uh, Bautista, and Encarnacion. So I picked them just because they were the, probably the best. Uh, first of all, you kind of want to aim for the Blue Zones. All right, well, I kind of screwed up there. Um, you want to aim for the Blue Zones. I, I don't really care about the score, so I can see some blue zones up top, so I just aim for those. And as you can see, that pitch comes in relatively quickly. And what I like to do against actual people is throw a changeup low, just below the zone. There it didn't get quite out, so, but he didn't swing. So you can do a couple things here. You can do something like a curveball low in the dirt, which I would do. And if he doesn't swing, that's fine. That sets you up for another fastball high, which you probably will blow right by him because he's throwing at about 100. I've hit 101 with him, so very filthy uh, player just in general. As you can see, the blue zones are basically on the corners. I like to go for the low and outside zone as much as possible. As you can see, that's a strike. I mean, that goes in relatively fast. If we go high and away here... This will allow us to go low and outside again, which means that's a perfect spot to put a curveball right there. Oh, Kevin Pillar. So that's nice contact. Uh, so you have a couple options. You can go up here, which is what I'm going to do. Or you could have gone on the outside part of the plate, but it doesn't really matter. I mean, he's throwing 101, and on when you're playing online, it's not you can't really react to that. It's almost like impossible to basically react, you just have to guess. Um, again, throw it. I like to throw it away from people. That's kind of what I like to do. I don't like to throw it inside. I prefer throwing it away, but as you can see, if there's a blue zone, I'm going to hit that blue zone. I haven't actually played against... I don't... Huh, that's weird. I'm not really playing against Tulowitzki or anybody. So again, this guy has you know, the high blue zones, so granted that's actually a strike in real life, but, so this guy's relatively, he's not swinging at anything, so I'll throw another change up low, oh, that slipped, maybe do a backdoor curveball since he's not swinging it, oh, there he goes, since you've thrown two low pitches now, you know, a high fastball is definitely in order, oh, and he definitely turned on that. Luckily, it was only a fly ball, no one was on base, and there's two outs. So that's kind of how I'm playing with him. As you can see, try and hit the low and outside corner all the time. That's really what I do with everybody. It's just the, I think it's the best way to pitch. And then mix it up where you throw in maybe a high fastball every now and again. Just because the high pitches are so much easier to, you know, hit out of the park. So... There's two out as he almost drops it. But anyways, that's this is going to be, you know, he's probably one of my favorite relief pitchers. He's a hard-throwing righty. Everyone needs one. If you go buy him right now, he's about a 1,000 stubs on the market. He, If you're playing against um, the computer, he's not as good because of the fact that the computer can still react. If you know what I mean, the computer will be able to react to his fastball, but he's still a dominant pitcher. Um... But in real life, guys, his pitches are amazing. 
His fastball with his speed is awesome. The only thing is when you throw his changeup, make sure you throw it really low because it's ba basically a batting practice fastball. So if they can get good contact on it, then it can definitely go for a home run. Um, maybe I have to like rank up to get to them. I don't know how. I want to face Tulowitzki and Donaldson and those people because that's... Uh, I don't want to really face these guys. You won't face these guys online. So anyways, as you can see, I'm basically just blowing the balls right by them. I'm very good at blowing balls and stuff, so it's honestly not that you know much of a difference for me. I do it in real life, I do it in video games, it's honestly not that big of a deal. So, make sure that you keep the ball, and make sure you're trying to hit the corners too. Don't throw the ball in the middle of the zone. Same thing, don't throw the ball in the sides either, don't throw it in the sides, throw it down low, as I probably walk him right now. Oh no. We got that good defense from Kansas City. So, uh, I guess we let it run. But uh, that's basically going to be my video for today. Cool. Um, I plan on doing a lot more of these for other pitchers too. I'm going to be doing one for, uh, what else? I'll be doing more. So, I hope you guys enjoy these videos. If you want to see any players that I... Uh, I play with, or if you want to see any players that you haven't played with, and then you want to be like, hey, I don't want to buy him yet until I know he's good, you know, ask me and I'll try and figure out, you know, what's good about him and what's not. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Um, that's basically uh, my deal with him. He's a great pitcher, works really well online, um, even, in, even in games too. I threw him, a, I think I've pitched him 10 games, I think he has like 30 strikeouts in 10 games. So he's honestly probably like one of the best pitchers for your money. Um, so I hope you guys enjoy this video again. I really hope you guys like it. And if you want to see anybody else, please leave in the comments below um, his name and just basically what team he's on. And I'll just come in here and I'll, I'll you know, pitch him or do whatever and try and figure out the best strategy for him. And uh, I hope you guys enjoy it and I will.